Greetings, everybody. Chaplain Bob here, Light of the World Ministries. Hey, um, you should take a look at something. It's called, uh, it's a gr worldwide group. They're uh, part of the United Nations or they're affiliated with it. They're a quasi United Nations multinational businesses and multi governmental organization. And the name is called Better Than Cash. So, uh, Better Than Cash. So, let's read about it on the About page. It's uh, betterthancash.org backslash about. And I'll leave the links up. About the Better Than Cash Alliance, based at the United Nations, the Better Than Cash Alliance is a partnership of governments, companies, and international organizations that accelerate the transition from cash to digital payments to advance the sustainable development goals. And then they brag about having 75 members. And... Uh, I was always wondering, how in the world are they going to implement this stuff in third world countries? Well, they're in Africa, South America, and uh, other places. So they say their purpose is, you know, to, uh, from cash to digital payments. Hey, guess what? When they decide to do uh, increase your taxes from 50% to 90%, what are you going to do about it? They just take the money. Boom. Oh, we don't like your social credit. Uh, we don't like the things you're saying online. Well, we're cutting you off for 30 days. So, uh, yeah, that's how that works. Uh, it seems like... Uh, Mark of the Beast isn't coming. It looks like it's about here. So, uh, they are, let's see, let me take a look. Resource Partners. Let's take a look at some of the people. Bill and Mel Gates Foundation. Mel. Melvin? I mean, I'm sorry. Melinda. L look at Melinda Gates and look at Bill and yeah uh, these are two wonderful people that want to uh, uh, they think the world's overcrowded and they want to give us a vaccination yeah because they care my heart is so touched so Bill and Mel Gates I mean Melinda uh, and then you've got the uh, German Federal Ministry for Economic Cooperation and Development. Now, you got to remember something. Germany is the leading force in the European Union. And then you got MasterCard. Uh, are you the master of the card, or is the card your master? And then there's another group uh, called Flourish. Omid, Omid Yar Group. I don't even know what they are. Uh, then the United States Agency for International Development. Uh, yeah, we're going broke and we're giving money to people for international development. The United Nations Capital Development Fund. Visa. So you got MasterCard and Visa. And then there's uh, CETA or CITA. It's part of the Swedish government, and uh, they want to reduce poverty. Uh, let's see. Then you got NORAD, which is Norway, uh, for Ministry of Climate Development. And then VIPS uh, is a smart payment company in Norway. Okay. Oh, and then you got the Catholic Relief Services. Uh, the Clinton Development Initiative. I mean, I know exactly how caring the Clintons are. Uh, I think it's really wonderful that they want to help 
implement all this stuff. Uh, European Bank for Reconstruction and Development. Uh, Inter-American Development Bank. Don't know who they are. And then you've got uh, International Labor Organization, part of the, I guess it's part of the UN, I don't know. Uh, International Telecommunication Union. Save the Children. The Global Fund to Fight AIDS, Tuberculosis, and Malaria. International Fund for Agricultural Development. The United Nations Refugee Agency. Okay. And uh, UNICEF, United Nations International Children's Fund. Uh, United Nations, you know, oh, the Population Fund for the United Nations, Universal Postal Union, Women's Banking, World Food Program, World Savings Banks Institute. Okay. All right, let's look at some of the governments. The Dominican Republic, Nepal, Jordan, Bangladesh, Pakistan, Papua New Guinea, Afghanistan, Benin, B-E-N-I-N. -E I've never even heard of that country. What the heck? Colombia. Oh, yeah, that'll stamp out all those drug dealers, huh? Yeah. Uh, African countries, Guinea, Ethiopia, Fiji, Ghana, India, Indonesia, Kenya, Lib Liberia. Uh, let's see what else. Malawi. Moldova, Paraguay, Peru, Rwanda, Sengal, Sierra Leone, Sierra Leone, Sudan, the Philippines, um, a lot of third world countries, Uganda, Uruguay, Vietnam, Solomons, and the United Mexican States, whatever that is. Is that Mexico, I guess? I Yeah. So... Well, right now they can use uh, your smartphone. And what's interesting is uh, when Obama was president and he was giving away those Obama phones, um, the person that was behind that, uh, the phones, was a guy named Carlos Slim. He is probably the richest guy in Mexico. And uh, he owns telecommunications in Mexico. He's one of the richest people in the world, but probably definitely the richest one in Mexico and um, so isn't it wonderful I didn't know that having a cell phone was a right uh, you know Obama phones right I mean you know when I was working two jobs going to college uh, I saw people with food stamps eating steaks I couldn't afford steaks twice a year but hey that's my white privilege, right? So, uh, yeah. Yeah, I was barely uh, surviving. But that's the way it goes, right? Uh, so, you know, that's... Uh, right now they're using phones. Don't be surprised if one day there's uh, uh, some kind of a microchip they inject into your hand or your forehead. I'm not saying that is the mark of the beast. I don't know, but I suspect and I believe that's what the Lord showed me. But then again, what can I tell you? All right. Uh, well, in John 8, 12, Jesus said, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. Somebody sent this to me. I thank them. They know who they are. The guilty party. Um yeah, so they're working on getting rid of cash, and with the the viral thing, uh, you know, oh, we got to get rid of dirty cash. Let's go to cashless. Let's go to digital cryptocurrency, Bitcoin. Anybody? Yeah, and the same crooks running the banks are going to be in charge of this. So you know it's going to be a dirty deal. But don't worry, the Clintons will. Keep everything on the straight and narrow and keep everything honest. I I have 100% confidence in them. So, all blessings of Jesus. Amen.